a very good morning to all my students of class 6th children welcome back to your civics class and today we are going to discuss the fill in the blanks true false and question and answers of chapter number 9 urban livelihood so all of you open your book open page number 279 and let's start with the discussion of fill in the blanks and the other exercises c first exercise is fill in the blanks I am reading this question for you all now. In big cities and towns, thousands of people earn their living by working on the streets and are called. In first blank, you will write hawker, and in second, you will write street vendors. In some big cities, selling goods and commodities is not allowed in busy areas as they tend to obstruct traffic and create jams. Number three, daily wage earners often have more working hours and are not paid sufficiently. For this, in most permanent jobs, the employees get a fixed salary at the end of the month and are entitled to certain benefits. Now let's come up to fifth question, which is. people having specific post with some predetermined job description question number b write true or false question number 1 employees in offices do not get regular salaries neither are they entitled to an increase in their salary this is false this statement is incorrect question number 2 Daily wage earners get paid on a daily basis. Yes, so the answer will be true. This statement is correct. Question number three: Hawkers and vendors selling different things on the streets do not own permanent shops. This statement is also correct. So here we will write true. Since there are more than one crore vendors in our country, their services cannot be banned. This is also. true this answer is also true the biggest fear for the hawkers and vendors face is from thieves and not the police this is false this statement is incorrect so let's come up to the question and answer part children first of all we are having answer the following questions in brief that means answer the following questions in short so let's start with the uh, discussion First question is how does a daily wage earner earn money this answer has been given on page number 277 so let's open page number 277 see you can see the topic over here the daily wage earner aap ye topic dekh sakte ho the daily wage earner yahan se aapka answer shuru hai there are many daily wage earners who work in different shops offices and factories and earn on a daily basis देर से लेकर डेली बेसिस तक यहां तक है आपका पहला पॉइंट उसके बाद आप वन टू थ्री फोर चार लाइनें छोड़ के नेक्स्ट लाइन में आओगे जहां से स्टार्ट है डेली वेज अर्नर ऑफन हैव लॉन्ग यहां से आपका आंसर स्टार्ट होगा डेली वेज अर्नर ऑफन हैव लॉन्ग वर्किंग आवर्स एंड डू नॉट गेट पेड सफिशियंटली देयर जॉब इज नॉट परमानेंट If a particular job gets over and the employer does not need them anymore, they have to look for work elsewhere. And there are no additional benefits in working as daily wage laborers. They are not entitled to holidays or sick leaves. So, they lose out on money if they fall sick as they are not able to go to work and earn their daily wages. Yahan tak hai aapka answer number 1 C. Now, Let's move on to question number 2. What are the special benefits enjoyed by employees with permanent job? This answer has been given on page number 278. Page number 278 pe aapka answer hai. So, you will open page number 278 aur usme aap work in in offices and factories wale paragraph mein aayenge. Last ki fourth line se aapka answer shuru hai. The employees get holidays during fe festivals and are entitled to annual leaves. Most importantly, people in permanent jobs have regular income and secure jobs. From the employees get holidays to regular income and secure jobs is your answer number two C. 
थर्ड क्वेश्चन आई हैव कट इट डाउन फॉर यू बिकॉज दिस वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस इन लॉन्ग नेक्स्ट इज क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर वाई आर हॉकर्स एंड वेंडर्स नॉट अलाउड इन एवरी पार्ट ऑफ द सिटी दिस आंसर हैज बीन गिवन ऑन पेज नंबर टू हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फाइव सो लेट्स ओपन पेज नंबर टू हंड्रेड एंड सेवेंटी फाइव ओके सो इन पेज नंबर टू हंड्रेड सेवेंटी फाइव यू विल सी द पैराग्राफ मीन्स ऑफ लाइवलीहुड ऑन द स्ट्रीट इन दिस यू हैव टू कम इन फिफ्थ लाइन आप इसकी फिफ्थ लाइन में आओगे जहां पे लिखा है हॉकर्स एंड स्ट्रीट फुल स्टॉप के बाद यहां से आपका आंसर शुरू है हॉकर्स एंड स्ट्रीट वेंडर्स जेनरली डिसाइड देम सेल्स वेयर टू सेट अप देयर शॉप्स व्हाट टू बाय एंड हाउ मच टू बाय मोस्ट ऑफ देम डू नॉट हैव इनफ मनी टू सेट अप परमानेंट शॉप्स सम ऑफ देम सेट अप देयर टेम्पररी शॉप्स ऑन द पेवमेंट्स वेयर दे डिस्प्ले देयर प्रोडक्ट्स ऑन द ग्राउंड some of them set up small kiosk on the pavements while some use carts and move from one place to another sellers of vegetables fruits and flowers bring their products in a basket aapka answer shuru hoga hawkers and street vendors se aur khatam hoga last line pe jo hai bring their products in a basket now children let's come up to नेक्स्ट सेक्शन विच इज आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन इन डिटेल फर्स्ट एंड सेकेंड क्वेश्चन आई हैव कट इट डाउन फॉर यू बिकॉज दिस वी हैव डिस्कस इन आंसर द फॉलोइंग क्वेश्चन इन ब्रीफ वी विल डू ओनली टू लॉन्ग आंसर क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री एंड क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री इज देयर आर मेनी रीजन वाई पीपल फ्रॉम विलेजेस टू सिटीज लिस्ट दीज रीजन आंसर इज गिवेन ऑन पेज नंबर टू हंड्रेड सेवेंटी सिक्स so all of you open page number 276 this answer will start from on the right hand side the second paragraph which is given below figure 9.4 aapka answer yahan se shuru hoga hawkers and vendor lead a very uncertain life as the police can dismantle their kiosk any time when people complain about their encroachment the police and the government try to uproot them then they have to shift base and set up their temporary shops elsewhere moreover heavy rains or extreme heat make people stay at home so when the streets are empty hawkers and street vendors have less business from hawkers and vendors to vendors have less business is your answer number 3 long now children let's come up to question number 4 which is both hawkers and lawyers are self employed but their condition in life is very different from one another what is the difference and how are their lives poles apart this answer has been mentioned on two pages which is page number 276 and page number 277 now let's come up to page number 276 so you can see the first paragraph over here just the below paragraph which is after figure 9.4 this complete paragraph is your answer 4d point number 1 i am reading this point for you hawkers and vendors are an important part of the economic life of any big city sometimes however some big cities do not allow them to work in busy areas because they tend to obstruct traffic and create jams the hawkers mainly encroach upon areas such as pavement and parking lots and pose difficulties to movement of pedestrian this is your answer 4d point number 1 your point number 2 will start from the next page which is page number 277 right hand side second paragraph the self employed can earn huge profit if their business flourishes businesses flourish all the shops in the market office of lawyers clinics owned by doctors and garment boutiques owned by costume designer are run by people who are self employed so this is your answer for the second point so here children your question answer section has been completed and we have completed with chapter number 9 civics urban livelihood you all have to complete your work in your civics notebook you have to send me the pictures of your work in your class group and you have to learn these chapters parallelly because this is going to come in your final term is that clear children so if you have any doubt ask me your doubts complete your work on time 
your work should be done in a very neat and clean and a proper handwriting i want all of you to watch my video and complete your work on time and start learning your work parallelly so for today thank you children and have a wonderful day